welcome everybody to this webinar and uh, you should be able to see this. A couple of uh, little things that I want to make you aware of. We are recording this webinar so we actually have people muted on this. We are going to uh, be opening it up for questions uh, at the end of this. Now the only way that we will be able to unmute you is if you have put your PIN number in there, your audio PIN, so make sure that uh, you have done so so that we can actually unmute you and you can ask questions at the end. There's been a lot of changes uh, and uh, with it now open, in, open enrollment AEP is going on. We definitely wanted to bring this uh, webinar to the forefront uh, during this period of time. A lot of things happening. I was talking to an agent just yesterday uh, saying that he's experienced a lot of people going back from uh, Med Advantage programs back to Medicare supplements. He seems to see, feel that there's a big pickup on that. And, you know, our experience with Stonebridge has been uh, nothing but uh, absolute uh, great pleasure to have them as a partner, and we want to continue to work with them as we have been, and you guys have been doing a great job with the uh, Stonebridge. As you can see on your screens, there is some major changes, and I wanted to have this webinar because of these changes, and there's a couple of things I want to point out to you. As uh, we go on to this webinar, I have invited uh, Lance Larson, which is the Vice President of Sales and Marketing for the Medicare Supplement. A lot of you get so uh, focused with uh, what you're doing, especially at AEP, that uh, you may not even be aware of this, but uh, Stonebridge has final expense too. And we're going to talk about that because they've got a really good program and some of the tools that they've developed for both the Medicare supplement and the final expense. So Lance will be covering that. But there's going to be a name change from Stonebridge. It's still going to be Stonebridge, but they're going to bring out the Transamerica name right out to the forefront. And Lance is going to cover the reason behind that and also uh, what the process is uh, about going about doing so. So with that, I want to introduce Lance Larson from Stonebridge. Lance, go right ahead. Thank you so much, David, and, and thank you, everybody, for taking time out of your Friday and, and I know very busy uh, annual enrollment season to, to join us on this webinar. Uh, as David mentioned, there's a lot of good things going on. Uh, with uh, Stonebridge and Transamerica, and, and, and we're very um, uh, happy uh, and excited to be working with American Independent Marketing, uh, which is one of our top organizations. So, David, thank you again for the opportunity to, to speak uh, today. So, as, as David mentioned, we've got uh, some changes coming uh, down the pipe, and, and very positive. Sometimes, of course, when you hear changes, that can be good or bad, but we're excited about these changes and that we are moving towards using that Transamerica name more than more and more. The first thing that, that I did is actually develop a new distribution name for my group that actually offers the final expense and the uh, Medicare supplement products. What you'll see going forward with a lot of the emails to yourself, our, our field partners, you'll see that Transamerica Supplemental Markets logo. One reason I really wanted to do that is to make sure that you as individuals in the field know that the Stonebridge life insurance products are part of the Transamerica family. So I think that was step one to make sure that you as our field partners understand the correlation or relationship between Stonebridge Life and Transamerica. The second thing that David alluded to is that we are actually moving forward with merging Stonebridge Life into a new statutory company that will be called Transamerica Premier Life. And so again, we really want to emphasize that, that name brand. I don't know if anybody's seen our, our uh, national uh, commercials. I actually had my mother-in-law two nights ago text me of all things and said, uh, Lance, I'm, I'm watching uh, Fox, and I just saw a Transamerica commercial. I'm very excited. So I guess uh, anytime your mother-in-law is excited, that's, that's a good thing. So we are really making a push to get that Transamerica name out there. And, and quite frankly, it's, it's going to be helpful for you 
uh, our field partners to have that um, brand recognition. It's one less thing that you're going to have to sell your client when you go into their home or, or pick up the phone and call them. Uh, we, we do have that recognition of individuals knowing, consumers knowing the name Transamerica. So, um, you know, the states that we are currently in for final expense and MedSup, uh, in the upcoming months we will be uh, transitioning that Stonebridge Life name into Transamerica Premier Life. So more to follow on that, but I think that's, uh, to me, it's, it's really kind of uh, uh, a wonderful one-two punch with our uh, distribution name moving to Transamerica Supplemental Markets and the actual statutory company moving to the Transamerica name as well. We've got a lot of good things to talk about, and I know you always hear that from the home office guy, but I really do think after uh, I go through these uh, slides briefly, you'll, you'll agree that we do have some really good things going on. Uh, Medicare Supplement, as, as all of you know, is a very competitive uh, product. There's a lot of great carriers out there looking for market share. And one thing that I know that I need to do from the home office is make sure we make this as easy as possible for you to do business with us. So one thing that we've done and we're very proud of is we have released an electronic application uh, as of approximately 15, 17 days ago, right around uh, October 1st. And you know, again, this is not something innovative. There's a lot of great carriers that have electronic apps, but we truly feel like this is a platform that's easy to use from a client and agent perspective uh, that offers a number of different signature uh, options for you to choose from and to make it simple. So our electronic app, if you're a licensed agent with us, you would just go to our agent web portal. You see the link on the screen there. There's a tab now on the, uh, the website, you know, just like if you click on forms, if you're looking to order materials, or if you click on our new business tab to check your pending business, there's actually an electronic app or e-app tab that you click on. And from there, we actually do have a number of, of really neat training modules, brain sharks. And these are not four hours long. You know, I, I understand I don't want to listen to something that, that goes on and on forever either. These are very short to the point how to do business with us, how to use the e-app, how to do the voice signature, how to use this and the iPad or whatever you choose. So Again, uh, I highly encourage you if, you, if you are using electronic uh, applications with some of your other carriers, uh, I, I would ask you to give us a chance to earn your business with our electronic app and give us a shot. Uh, and if you've never used an electronic app, you know, wh what a great time to try it. it I, I assure you, uh, we will hold your hand, make it easy for you, and, and you know, quite frankly, be able to send a clean app in where we can sub get it submitted and placed you know, if we're in uh, states where we're doing uh, the guarantee issue type business, we're placing apps uh, with the electronic apps same day. You know, and that's good for the client. They get their policy faster. They get their card faster. You get paid faster. It really is a win-win-win for the home office, uh, the field partners, uh, and your uh, clients. This is a screenshot of the, the web page we have for the electronic app. You can see there's a picture of a, a good-looking dog on there. What we're doing, just again, just to give everybody a chance to uh, uh, make a little money and, and give them the opportunity to, uh, for us to uh, hopefully win them over with our electronic app, everybody that sends us and places uh, five apps electronically, we're going to send them an extra $250. So $50 an app for those first five apps uh, um, we'll send to you just for the chance to uh, have you try our electronic application. I really like it. I can't, you know, you can tell I'm excited. You know, we have the voice signature that, that's working very well. We have the traditional email, what we call click wrap signature, where you send the client an email and they review it and, and, and sign it via their uh, web portal. And then we also have, which I think is really neat, uh, an iPad signature. So you can do these on your iPad and, and, and you can either sign it with a stylus or with, a, with your finger. So I think it's just something that is... Uh, Really, really cool, and we're seeing a lot of agents uh, utilize this because, again, you can't submit it to us if it's not filled out all the way. And you know, we all think we're uh, uh, pretty uh, concise sometimes, but you know, there's always a chance where we miss something on the app. 
the electronic application helps self-scrub for you. So again, it'll say in red, hey, you know, just like if you try to order something from Amazon, you forget your zip code, it will say, you know, Mr. Larson, you forgot your zip code, please fill it in. Same type of deal with the electronic app. So when you submit it to us, it's a clean app. It goes right into our admin system. We don't have to fat finger it or don't have a chance to fat finger it, I should say. It's going to get clean, less amendments, less endorsements, less messing around, quite frankly. So we, we are very, very interested in making this electronic app work. So again, if you're using electronic apps, I encourage you to use ours. If you've never used one, uh, please give us a chance. Uh, we actually do. Um, training, live training every single week, every Thursday uh, at 12 noon, your time. Think about it on the West Coast. Think about it as maybe like a lunch and learn. You know, grab a sandwich, uh, log in, and uh, my relationship manager, Chris Garrett, walks through that electronic application and shows you the, the highlights of being able to get through there. So again, we, we really do feel like there's a lot of benefits for those electronic application. And even if, last thing I'll say, even if you're, you're one person, because I did talk to a gentleman last week that said, Lance, I like to have kitchen table sales eyeball to eyeball. My clients don't want to sign something electronically. Completely understand there's definitely those individuals out there. What I would say to that is, even as an agent, why not use the electronic application, fill it all the way out. There's an option for wet signature. You push that button, it prints out all of the forms, nice and neat, neatly filled out. It's been scrubbed. You can take that to your appointment. It fills in the premium. All you have to do is the client sign it. So when you fax that or mail that hard copy to us just like you would a paper app, you know that it's a clean app. So I do have agents that are truly not wanting to use electronic. They're still using the e-app as a sales aid for them to fill out the apps prior to the client meetings. And Lance, one last thing is, is we've had uh, already in the short period of time that you launched this, uh, quite a few agents that have already uh, used this, and I've had some feedback uh, that they really like this option and it's been real easy. I, I do want to encourage to, if you guys have extra time, that they're always running those uh, webinars to learn that product. It just makes your life uh, so much easier. You get things done quicker. And probably the, the biggest thing that we see is it expands your territory. It allows you to work in other states and fur, further outreaches in places that cost you too much time and money to go out and see people in that. And this allows you to do this and reach out even further than what you have been in the past. Yeah, thank you, David. And actually, a, a, a great example of that is you know we actually have our Medicare supplement approved in Hawaii of all places and you know since we've had it approved we've had very little activity there as you can imagine but since we've had this electronic app we've actually seen our activity spike up and it, quite frankly it's from individuals that have the uh, the voice signature and they're doing that business over the phone uh, and you know obviously it would be great for all of us to travel to Hawaii at certain times of the year but it just goes to show you it does extend uh, your reach so I think that's a that's a great point David so again, the incentive contest, uh, place five apps electronically, and we'll actually uh, send you $250 just for uh, giving us a shot. So in, on top of the compensation you're used to, uh, we'll send you a little bit more. Another thing we're doing right now that, that we really like is our lead program. We do have an opportunity for every seven MedSup policies submitted. We uh, will send out, and actually not we, I actually will just pay for it. You will work with Kramerly Marketing. Um, Kramerly Marketing will call you and ask you directly, you know, what age range do you want to, you know, utilize, what zip codes. You know, really you get to pick the variables. All uh, I'm doing is footing the bill. So, again, for every seven Medicare supplement policies submitted, and actually it should say in place, we do want them placed uh, as well, but we'll actually pay for a thousand lead mailer uh, drop from Kramer Lead Marketing. We've had a lot of agents take advantage of this and, and the uh, returns have been very, very good. So this is not something that you can do it once and you're done. If, if you, you, know, you jump on board with Stonebridge and start writing with us, you can keep getting uh, a thousand, a thousand, a thousand every time you write seven. So uh, if you haven't had a chance to uh, take advantage of this, I highly encourage you to do so. 
Another neat thing that I'm really proud of is our new consumer advertising. You know, I do get conversations and calls from individuals like yourself uh, daily, quite frankly, of, of with the question of why or how can I get some materials that are approved. You know, Lance, I want to put my headshot on something. I want to put my logo on something, my, my, um, my name, rank, serial number, and, and really promote myself and the rates that you're offering. So what we did is we developed a number of postcards, a number of flyers, some letters, some emails, newspaper ads. Um, and what we've done is we've sent these to all the states that were approved for Medicare supplement today and got approvals. So all of these materials, if you go to our website, you can go in and say, I want 10 of these, I want 1,000 of those, whatever you'd like to do. You drop your logo in, you drop your headshot in, you put the information on it and we'll print those for you. They're very, very cheap, 10 cents a piece uh, to print these postcards and these flyers. So, you know, for, for $100, you can get 1,000 of these postcards. You know, the, I just, this is just one example on the screen. You can actually even change the, uh, the graphics. So there's different graphics, different pictures of people you can choose from. You know, some people are like, well, I, I don't want a golfer on there. I want somebody that's, uh, you know, running down the beach. We have that availability. So it truly is a personalized marketing material uh, platform that we offer to all of our licensed agents. We can print them and send them to you. If you want to upload a list, we can actually go all the way turnkey and we can print them and send them out, mail them out. So we can do exactly as much or as little as you'd like us to do. Uh, this postcard that you see on the screen, I actually have a lot of agents that are ordering these types of postcards and they're putting their logo or, or headshot on there and their information and they're using them as big business cards. They're not even like mailing them out, but they're actually just using them to hand out uh, to have in their office. So again, you don't have to order a max amount or a min amount. If you just want a smaller amount, we can do that. The nice thing is we have a, a good relationship with our vendor. But I did want to point out that these types of materials are available for you. They're all approved. You drop your stuff in. We print them. We get them to you right away. And I think, Lance, uh, another key point here is is that um, we at AIM and Stonebridge have sent out information on this in, in the past. And as all of us get busy and as all of us get inundated by emails, this could have gone by. So being a part of this webinar, uh, you're seeing what uh, Stonebridge has for tools for you to uh, get uh, new clients in front of new clients in, in and add additional clients. You know, I've said to many uh, producers out there before, the selling is the easy part of this business. The hard part of this business is getting in front of qualified prospects. Stonebridge is making it very easy for you to do that by doing pieces like this for you and giving you the ability to even curtail it and uh, customize it to the way you would like it. And on top of it, uh, spending money to help you with your marketing. It's all about growing your business and helping that, and we all benefit by it. So if we've given you the tools, we're actually helping pay for the lead drops and that type of thing. This is going to help all of you succeed, in, especially at this time at AEP. Great point, David. Thank you very much. So, you know, just another slide here that shows the flyer. You know, it, it's something very simple. Um, and, and actually, uh, uh, we can also put the rates on there as well. You know, I've had uh, an individual last week that called me that, that ordered a number of uh, the postcards uh, that had done a, a, a large block of business with, with another carrier where a carrier has uh, bumped those rates up, where the Stonebridge rates are, are, are much more competitive. So this is an opportunity to, to be able to get in front of his current clients very quickly with something nice and, and, and vibrant uh, and professional. Uh, with his information on it as well. So again, we, we, we love the opportunity to ha have these pieces and they're there available for you. Another neat thing, again, you're going to see the theme today with this webinar is just showing all the different extras we have. You know, I think that's, that's the big thing is trying to make life easier for you, our field partner. One thing that I think is really neat is we have a mobile rate calculator 
for the rates. You know, if you remember the old school, and, and some of us still do it, but you know, the rate sheets for final expense, you know, and I'm trying to figure out the calculation for uh, different rate classes, and then with MedSup, you know, what zip, or you know, in some states it's, it's one rate, but different ages. We actually developed a rate calculator, and you see the links at the bottom. Uh, we did one for final expense, we did one for MedSup, and then the graphic that you see, it works for iPhones and Androids, like a Google type phone, and Blackberries. It's nice, I mean, it's crisp, it's clean. You type in, I've got a 75-year-old female, and, and you know, they want to do this, this, or this. You hit submit, and we're being able to generate uh, a number back. It's just a calculator, it's a mobile website. I actually uh, keep a uh, uh, a shortcut on my, my phone on my front screen. So anytime somebody says, Lance, you know, how do your rates look in California, in Southern California, or how do they look in somewhere in uh, Pennsylvania? I don't have to carry uh, all of those rate sheets, or I don't have to, uh, you know, figure out on my calculator what the final expense rate is. I can simply and easily and quickly uh, go to my phone and find out those rates. So again, another really neat little extra. I encourage you to, if you, and again, those links is to type those links into your phone. It'll pop right up, fe-sbl.mcreamcalc.com, and then you just have to simply change the first two letters, MS for MedSup, you know, ms -s, excuse me, ms-sbl.mcreamcalc.com. If you have any questions about that, Please call us and let us know. But again, it's just a, it's another nice, uh, neat little thing that we have to make uh, hopefully your lives easier. You know, as David mentioned earlier, uh, you know, we, we get so busy with annual enrollment, and, and rightfully so. It's a it's a good time of the year. Uh, you know, we we see our activity rise just like your activity. But as David mentioned, one thing I do want to point out is we actually do offer a very competitive final expense product, a very simple, easy to understand final expense product. And one thing I've seen with successful field partners is being able to, with all of the sheer number of clients they have with MedAdvantage and MedSup, these are definitely prime prospects to be able to go back after you take a breather uh, after the first of the year and go back and, and with the savings you, you know, that you've done with their, with their uh, deals is to be able to look at final expense life insurance as well. Similar to the MedSup, it really is that simplified underwriting and issue process. You know, there's not a lot of in-depth underwriting on a final expense policy. In fact, with our product, it's a cascading application. And what I mean by that is it's broken out into sections where we ask you a number of questions to start out in section one. And it says, if you've answered yes to any of the questions, uh, thank you, but you're not eligible. So, you know, we have three sections where the first one, you pass through, uh, you get to move to, the, it's kind of like Monopoly, you get to pass, go, collect 200. Uh, if you don't, uh, it's, it's just don't even send it in. If you move to the second section, that's going to tell us if they're going to be uh, uh, eligible for uh, our standard product or our graded product. And then last but not least, uh, it's going to say, uh, the, la the third set of uh, questions is going to be, are you preferred status or are you um, um, standard status? So you know right away, once you go through the app answering the questions, where your client's going to stand. So it, it really is a nice, easy to use uh, final expense product. I thought this was interesting, and, and this is from 2012, and, and I'm sure um, I need to get more updated stats, but I'm sure they haven't... Uh, uh, you know, veered too far off from, from where you see on the screen here. And some of you have probably seen this several times before, but just briefly, 39% of households uh, recall being approached or provided information about buying life insurance over the last few years. Um, you know, so that's, you know, less than half of people can recall. But I think the interesting one uh, is, is the third bullet, you know, age 65 or older, only 17% of them were approached. So, you know, thinking about, uh, you know, in our wheelhouse of age 65 and older, talking about MedAdvantage, talking about MedSup, boy, I mean, only 17% of those are getting approached by life insurance. So it's really, to me, that's an opportunity uh, for, for all of you that haven't had that opportunity or, or, or thought about doing life insurance. Let me give you a product that's simple, similar to what you're used to with MedSup, 
that you can approach them with to take care of their final expenses. As you can see there, you know, life insurance ownership, 50 year low, and only one third of Americans own an individual life policy. You know, a lot of people maybe have it. You know, I work for Transamerica. You know, they offer a, you know, a term policy based on my salary. You know, and, and you know, of course, that's not enough for uh, my family and my four children. But a lot of times, that's the only insurance uh, people own. So only one third of Americans owning an individual life policy is just a heck of an opportunity for all of us on this call. You know, the, getting back to my final expense with Stonebridge. You know, there's a lot of good carriers that offer final expense, but I. I think we truly stand out due to the fact, a number of reasons, you know, underwriting for us uh, is very, very competitive. Over 100,000 cases were uh, sent in to us and issued uh, in 2013 uh, for all of Transamerica, and over 69% of those were preferred status. So, I mean, I'm just a corn-fed Iowa boy, but, you know, almost 70% of all the cases are getting preferred. What I like to joke about is you really have to be pretty sick not to get preferred. I actually take a step further and, and say if somebody's using and using file expense with Carrier X, I say you almost have to compare their standard rate to our preferred rate because a lot of times a carrier has a preferred rate but it's like the holy grail. You can't get it. With us, you know, 70, almost 70% 70 of the time, we are giving preferred status. As you can see on that first bullet point, no height and weight restrictions, ages 45 to 85. I mean, that's a big deal as well. Uh, no point of sale interview. You know, you go in, you make the sale, again, with that application that I talked about. You go through the questions, the three sections, you know where the client stands. Uh, we don't make you go through another point of sale interview. We're only doing reactive PHIs on about 12% of the, of the cases. So instead of a, a carrier where it makes you do it 100% of the time, we'd rather just do it reactively uh, less than 15% of the time. We offer, like I said, a full death benefit product and a graded death benefit. Now one thing I do have is an asterisk on that Stonebridge Security 2. That's that graded death benefit. That is not approved or available in the state of Washington. So. Uh, my friends that are on the phone in Washington, you have the final expense available to you. You have the full death benefit version, but you would not have the graded. And quite frankly, that's not a big deal. And the reason I say that is only 6% of all of our cases last year within Transamerica had the graded version. Again, you've got to be pretty darn sick to actually not qualify for standard or preferred. Only 6% got the graded. So Washington, uh, my friends in Washington, you don't have the graded death benefit, but don't fret because it's quite frankly not going to come into play with us very often. We've also got a, some nice bells and whistles with the final expense product. One of them is the accelerated death benefit rider uh, with or without nursing home. Essentially what that does is it gets the death benefit accelerated. For example, let's say a client goes into a nursing home that had $25,000 of coverage. They would be able to get access to the majority of that $25,000. It's really a nice nice deal. If they're, if they're diagnosed with a terminal illness, they can get access to that death benefit prior to death. Uh, accidental death benefit, right? There, you know, that's the, you know, that's an option to purchase more coverage. So if you, let's say you have a client that purchases 25,000, they would actually be able to add another 25 grand to the death benefit. And if they perished in an accident, they would get 50,000. So that one is a, uh, an optional rider, the actual death benefit. There's a cost to that one that's in our rate guide. You can actually do it on our mobile rate calculator as well. The accelerated death benefit rider, if the state has approved it, it's automatically added to the product. Another neat little rider is called the children's and grandchildren's benefit rider. You know, for example, let's say you go to Grandma Smith and she wants to get some, uh, some final expense uh, coverage. She can actually buy term coverage up to $5,000 for each of her grandchildren. And it's only 10 bucks a year. I mean, this is nothing. Uh, so they can do, you know, again, we know 5000 isn't a lot of, of money, but it's guaranteed. Uh, you know, it's, it's one of those things where we're not asking any underwriting questions. So she can have, uh, you know, she has four grandchildren. 
for $40 a year, she can have $5,000 coverage on each of those grandkids. Guarantee issue, you know, so if a kid's got spina bifida, kid's got uh, Down syndrome, uh, doesn't matter. We're not asking questions, so they'll have that. So, again, it's a neat thing. It's, it's not going to light the world on fire from a coverage standpoint, but I'll tell you, what agents have told me is for, for $10 a year, it's a no-brainer to add that to the policy. And the reason being is what they tell me, it's a great persistency tool. Think that you think of this. If you go in and you sell Grandma Smith a policy and she puts grandson Timmy on this, somebody comes in behind you a month, two months, three months later and says, well, Mrs. Jones, I've got a final expense policy with Courier X and it's a little bit cheaper. How about we make the move? And Grandma Smith says, well, that sounds you know pretty good, but what about this, this uh, writer, this 5,000 coverage I have for my grandson Timmy? Uh, you know, a lot of carriers don't have this uh, same writer, and the agent's going to have to say, well, you know, I don't have that. Guess what? Grandma Smith is, is not going to uh, go with them. They're going to keep their Stonebridge policy because they, she wants to keep uh, that coverage open for grandson Timmy. So, again, it's, it's a neat little uh, grandchild child writer. Uh, if you need more uh, information about it, uh, we've got that uh, in our uh, kit of materials. So one thing I, I wanted to do uh, is tell you a little bit about Ireland. And uh, we're, we're very, very excited about this. You know, we, we had an Asian incentive trip that just wrapped up uh, a couple weeks ago for, uh, for Panama. Uh, and we are taking uh, our top 50 producers to Panama. We're going to have a really good time. Some of you on the call may be uh, going with us and hope to see you there. One thing I wanted to do is try to up the ante a bit, you know, and sometimes that's hard to do, but I think we have done. I think we've hit a home run in that we are offering a trip to Ireland. The uh, qualification uh, uh, period just started a couple weeks ago. I wanted to do it during annual enrollment, so all of the business you're ha happening to write, final expense or meds up during the annual enrollment period uh, and beyond, that's a 12-month qualification, will qualify for this. Uh, we're going to be going to the, uh, the the hotel, I think it's the Hotel Europe, actually, not the Europe Hotel um, and Resort, but that's in Killarney, Ireland. And you can see it's gonna, we're going to go in June, so hopefully we're going to get some really nice weather. $225,000 of convention credits. You know, if you think about the average annual MedSub premium, you'd be averaging about three apps a week during the contest period, and that's going to get you to Ireland. So we're very excited about offering this incentive trip to you and, and, and you need to know that hey you know right now you can be writing business during annual enrollment it's going to qualify for this trip we and one thing different I'll, the last thing I'll mention about this and, and this is a really important our last trip to Panama we took the top 50 I mean if you're number 51 and did a lot of business unfortunately uh, you're staying home with this trip anyone that hits that magical number anyone that hits the 225 gets to go. So if I have 50 people, if I have 75 people, if I have 125 people, them and a guest will go. So you're not competing against anyone else but yourself with this trip. You just got to set a goal. You got to set a, a, a guideline of I've got to hit this number every month and me and a guest are going to go and have a pint with Lance uh, at the in the Emerald Isle. So again, don't, don't miss out on this trip. It, it, we're going to do it upright and we're going to have a lot of fun. So we're very uh, we're very excited about that. And Lance, uh, let me just uh, say something. I went to uh, the to Killarney this year, uh, and actually stayed at the Hotel Europe. And for the people that are listening to this uh, webinar, I'm telling you, it's an incredible place. The hotel is just unbelievable. It's right on the lake. It's got views that you can't believe. There's all kinds of things to go see and, and do. Uh, a tour that I uh, took was uh, the Gap of Dunlo, and it is something that you'll be talking about for years and years. It's just an incredible place to go. So I'm just encouraging you. It's worth going after this trip. It would be a trip of a lifetime, and you would enjoy yourself. I appreciate that. I appreciate the plug, uh, David. Um, we, we, yeah, we, we are definitely uh, geared up to uh, make that a, a trip of a lifetime, something uh, everyone that joins us will remember for a long time. Last thing I just quickly wanted to touch on, you know, there's a lot of great carriers out 
there. A lot of curious, uh, all of you represent. And, and one thing I, I like to just say, you know, why, you know, why do business with us? There's a, again, there's, there's, there's great products out there, great carriers. I truly feel that we offer the best of both worlds. And what I mean by that is that with Transamerica, you know, it is a big company. We have deep pockets. We've got great ratings. Uh, you know, it is a wonderful place. And, it, you know, there are a lot of benefits of working for a big company. But I also think at the same time we have a special opportunity to have a, a really close relationship, and you have a great uh, opportunity to have a relationship with the leaders at the home office. You know, the majority of our employees are here in the Midwest, in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Uh, over 3,000 employees are here uh, in this small uh, city in Iowa. And, and, and the nice thing about that is we've got the mentality where we are going to pick up the phone. Uh, if you need a, a question answered by an underwriter, the underwriter is going to pick up the phone and talk to you. You know, uh, as David will tell you, uh, you know, if you call me, I'm going to call you back. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to big time you. We, we really do truly feel good about having uh, a, a big time uh, company, but also being able to have personal relationships with the agents, whether it be uh, myself, underwriting new business, customer service, et cetera. So it really is a situation where I feel like we offer the, the best of both worlds. Well, I think uh, we can open it up to questions, but, you know, again, I, I wanted to thank uh, uh, American Independent Marketing and, and my friend David Wayne for, for allowing me to, to talk with you and, and, and give you some, some news on some of the exciting things we're doing. But uh, if you haven't had a chance to, to take, uh, you know, a, 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 an opportunity to write business with Stonebridge Life, uh, I would love the chance to earn your bid. And I know uh, David uh, and, and his team will take good care of you and uh, get you everything you need. But uh, with that, uh, David, do we want to open up for questions? Yeah, I think uh, we're pro in the process of uh, doing that right now. And just to let you know, if you didn't put in your PIN code it, it, for audio, it, we can't unmute you. So please do that if you haven't done that. A um, couple of things I wanted to share with you. You know, uh, Lance was saying his uh, personal touch. I, uh, this year, Lance and I did a little road trip around Washington and Oregon, and I dr drug him around to see some agencies and some of you guys out there. And, you know, the bottom line is, is uh, how often does a vice president go out there on the road and actually stop in at agencies and that type of thing? So the touch is really there. The interest is there to help you. If you uh, uh, are not going to ask questions and you still want to hear this, put your uh, phone on mute and hit star six. That will help. Um, I also want to mention we're going to have uh, next Tuesday our connected agent uh, call at 9 o'clock. If you belong to the connected agent or want to belong, please sign up for that. And Wednesday we're going to do an LTC awareness uh, webinar next Wednesday too. So. Look for the emails, and we'll have those types of things. Do we have any questions out there on the Stone Bridge and what we covered today? How do we ask a question? You just go ahead and ask. Uh, question on the child rider. You gave an example of $10 per child on that rider. Is that correct, or is it $10 that would cover up to nine children? That's a great question. It would be ten dollars per kid. So our our system. The only reason we chose nine. That's that's really not an arbitrary number, except that our system will only let us, you know, log in nine grandchildren. But what we what we how to get around that? Let's say if you do have eight grandkids, you can write a final expense case for grandma and put nine of them on there, and you can write one for grandpa and put the other nine on there. But it is ten dollars per kid. Okay. Thank you. Per year. Yep. Lance, it's $10 per kid per month. Per year. No, per year. That's an annual number. I mean, it's it's it's, it's just, it's almost. <laughs> no, it's, 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 hey, we got some background there. Um, I don't throw animal over here. Uh, so, anyway, um, any other questions out there? Well, it's a What do you think? Very sorry. We got a, quite an interesting conversation going on. So, 
Um, okay, since we do have this, we're going to end this conversation. Lance, thanks very much for doing this. We appreciate it.